Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Oluchi, a makeup artist and an esthetician. In this video, I am going to show you how to incorporate these two products in your skincare routine. Any CeraVe cleanser that you have and the Advanced Nail 96 Mucin Power Essence. So first things first, you always have to ensure your hands are washed. So I am going in with a hand wash just to quickly wash my hands and ensure that I don't have dirt, you know, on my hands before putting that on my face because you don't want to introduce germs. And now that I'm done washing my hands, you want to go in with one pump of your cleanser and in this case I have the CeraVe Foaming Cleanser, sorry, the CeraVe Blemish Control Cleanser. So just one pump will do like so and rub your hands together and I always like to put a bit of water on my palm just to make sure the cleanser foams so this is how you want to do it take your time massage the cleanser on your face just like I'm doing you need to spend about 60 seconds doing this and of course not forgetting your neck so this is how you want to go into your cleanser. Remember your eyes, the back of your ears. Just take your time and massage, massage, massage your face. So at this point, you want to rinse your face. Thoroughly. And when rinsing your face, don't keep away from using hot water. Instead, use lukewarm water to rinse your face. So after rinsing your face, if you have a hydrating toner, this is the point where you use it. Note that I mentioned hydrating toner. So for me, I have this toner from Simon Urian and it's a rebalancing toner. So I am just going to place it on the cotton pad and that's what you want to do. You know, just wipe your entire face and if you do not know the essence of toning the face, is just to ensure that you take off the dirt on your face i mean the ones that the cleanser didn't get to take off so that's what you want to do that's the essence of one of the reasons for using a toner and also this is a rebalancing toner so basically it helps to balance the skin's ph so this is how you want to use your toner after washing your face and like I said it's optional if you have a toner. So now that I'm done using this toner you can see that my face is somewhat moist. It's you know it has it's damp basically it is not dry. So in the absence of having a toner you can just go back with tap water you know splash some tap water on the face just to ensure that the face is damp before you apply the next product and in this case I'm just going to spritz my face with this Avini um, EU thermal, thermal Spring Water it's basically water so you just want to spritz your face the essence is that I want to dampen my skin because the next product which is the snow mucin works best on damp skin because it's a hydrating product and any hydrating product you want to use ensure that your skin is damp that's when you get the most out of it so i usually go in with two pumps just like so one and two that's enough no more no less so massage it together and then pat it on my skin you know so take your time pat it pat it on the skin and of course bring it down to the neck because whatever treatment you give to your face you give the same treatment to your neck so you see how i'm patting it i'm not rubbing it vigorously i'm just taking my time and patting it on my skin that's how you get the most out of this amazing hydrating serum i've done a review on this product I'll be sure to link it here for you guys to see and also in the description box. So do check it out. Some of the comments I got was that, oh, it's if people find it drying and all that. You will only find it drying if you do not use it properly. And that is the essence of this video. So now that I'm done applying, you don't end here because a lot of people I see as well, they just end here. Do not end at this point. Just before you apply the next product, 
ensure you wait for your skin to for the product to fully absorb so just give it some time you know for it to fully absorb into the skin and so after allowing it to fully absorb if you have other serums or treatments this is the point where you apply them otherwise if you do not have them what you want to do at this point is to go over the face with your moisturizer and moisturizer of your choice and if it's nighttime, that's where your skincare routine ends. However, if it's in the daytime, after using your moisturizer, end with an SPF and that's it. So basically, this is how to use your CeraVe cleanser and the snail mucin in a nutshell. I hope you guys found this video really helpful. You know, I try to make my videos as concise as possible, not to let you know just so that you guys get the point and everything so if you have any questions do not hesitate to drop them in the comment section below i'll do my best to answer them and if you have any other video suggestions drop them in the comment section below and i'll be sure to you know try to answer your questions to the videos and everything so i will catch you in my next one thanks for watching guys bye